1826, the Frenchman Champollion was able to decipher it. Then there was a lot to read. He had a story of Rosette as a story with a text in Greek, in Greek and in hieroglyphics. That gave him the possibility to the key to this disciple. And it was a lot to read uh, in the temple. As you can see, there are a lot of people who want to get in. Um, we've just done a tour. It was about two hours. It was a pretty good tour. Um, so we're just going to wander around the gardens first, and then we're going on a bus to go to Versailles. Um, after that, the plan is to go to the Eiffel Tower and go up. It looks like it's open today, so hopefully we can get there. It's so pretty here, though. Oh good. Oh good. Oh look, there's what the tower. Does it make? Yeah, there's the tower. Just to go? Just up there. It is Wednesday. Or do you want a date? 29th. Um, look at that line though, that's crazy. What is that? That's the entrance. Or one of the entrances. Yeah. That's where the water and stuff is, so we're going to head out there. Oh cool, so we go over there? Yeah. Um, yeah, so... You alright? Yeah, Please don't fall again. Okay. Um, yeah, so we're going to go to Versailles, hopefully go up the tower, get some dinner. I feel like there's something that I'm missing that we're going to do today. Tower? I said that. Versailles? said that. Dinner? said that. Dessert? Tower? Dessert. That's part of dinner. <laughs> that is part of the meal. Extra dessert? Um, I don't know. Anyway, uh, we'll see what happens and I'll update you when we're on the bus and stuff. Alright, talk soon. How did you put the seat down? There's a button. Oh, there. You have a lever. I have back. a lever. <gasps> the seat moves back. Are you recording? I am recording. Oh, so you make someone take a photo? Yeah, we can take a photo. I just want to record that part. Oh, she, can, she can edit them, babe. I can edit, yeah. Okay, so while I wait for these two to come out of the gift shop so that we can go back to our bus, I'm just going to vent quickly because I've been on a fair few tours, not just this trip but in general. And there's always very simple instructions to follow and people never follow them and a lot of common sense and common courtesy. So first of all, we were told no flash photography. Yep. And that's to preserve paintings and things like that. So what do people do? Take flash photography. Second thing was, um, in some of the rooms it said for people to not stop and linger because of the fact that it's quite a small room and you need to keep the flow of the tours going. And what do people do? They stopped. We had one woman stop and crowd in and then complain because she said they were moving too quickly. So that was that. And then you've got common courtesy. So basically don't stop in the middle of a footpath. That'd be great. Uh, please stop running into me because honestly I had to turn around to Shay today and go, am I wearing a sign that says please run into me because everyone was running into me and it was very, very irritating. Um, yeah, it's just... I've been on many tours and this frustrates me so much every single time and it angers me so much every single time. Um, and it just kind of ruins part of the day for me. But common courtesy people, like just please, thank you is the first part of it, honestly. Um, anyway, so this is this is the castle. Now I've been to Schumbrunn in Vienna. I thought that palace and those gardens were huge. This is bigger. This is so much bigger. I think. The gardens might be a bit bigger because they've got a zoo and a maze and all that kind of stuff, but this place is huge. It is I'm amazed that we got through as much as we got through in time. So 
Yeah. Um, anyway, I'm waiting for these guys to come back. And we're going on the bus. And then we're going back so that we can get dinner. And then go to the Eiffel Tower. And then go back to the hotel and pack because we've got to leave tomorrow morning. Alright, talk soon. Oh, look, place to kiss. Hello. Yeah, like this guy was like going to walk over the Oh, wow, that's a deal. I love it. Is the sort of person that would be jumping, bungee jumping off the Eiffel Tower? I'd love to bungee jump. I've never done it before, but I'd love to. I'd love to skydive one day too. Oh no, not from here. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't do that. I'm not that mental. <laughs> okay, big will get home. <laughs> <laughs> well, I am going home. <laughs> Just give me a month. Go home, we'll go splat. <laughs> we are back and very tired because it's like 11. No, I'm not going to. I'm not, I'm not silly. I'm not silly. Um, yeah, did you see my, did you see my bag tag? Shay? What? Look, it broke and the thing came out. Uh, oh, no. Oh. You know, um, yeah. Um, yeah, so we've just had to pack. Um, we've had a great time here. And we've had really good food. And I'm still full from dinner. Uh, it rained while we were at the Eiffel Tower. But it wasn't enough for me to care, so it's fine. Um, it's quite warm in here. Do you want to open the window? It is open. Do you want to open another window? No, it's fine. Do you not think it's warm? I got a shirt off, so I don't really notice. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> um. Anyway, so we've got to get up really early tomorrow morning because we've got to get the train at nine, right? Yeah, nine. And. So we've got to walk to the station, and I've got to map that out. And as you can see, I've got a whole bunch of stuff on my bed, which I've got to sort out as well. And yeah, that's today. That's done.